Welcome to this video guys. In this video, I'll show you how you can install Seaborn and we will run some project that uses Seaborn. So first of all, I have the simple Python project here or a simple Python file here. So let's see what we have here. So in this file, we have this simple code here. We're just importing a few libraries and in Seaborn, there is an error that's saying Seaborn could not be resolved. Now that's because Seaborn is not installed. Let's verify if it is not installed. So Go to your project folder and just open command prompt. Now, to check if Seaborn is installed or not, what you can do is just type Python here and try to import Seaborn. And if I hit enter, as you can see, it is saying module not found, no module named Seaborn. So let's install it. I'll exit from this Python console by typing exit, hit enter, and now we are back in our command prompt. Now let's check our python version so the command is python double dash version and as you can see the python version is 3.12.1 now to install we will use pip so if i type just pip here as you can see i'm given a list of options here that i can use with pip now if you are not seeing in this if you are seeing something uh, error that says pip is not recognized something like this what you can do is you need to install pip or you need to add pip to your environment variable check the link in the description below if you don't have pip installed you will see how you can install pip all right now once pip is there or you if you, if you already have pip you can just type pip install seaborn and hit enter and seaborn will be installed in your python 3.12 while this is processing check out our brand new awesome coding mods we've got t-shirts hoodies we've got stickers for laptops or notebooks cups bags and a lot more Get it today from the link below. As you can see, Seaborn is now being installed. And now if I go back to Python console by typing Python, and now if I write Seaborn, as you can see, we don't face any error and Seaborn is being imported. So this is how you can install Seaborn. Now let's run our code here and let's see if this is actually working. Now here also, as you can see, the warning is gone. Now if I run this as you can see our code is now running and we have no error and our graph is printed so this is how you can install seaborn and yeah there's a sample code that uses seaborn here if you have any questions let me know in the comments below